They have played their heart out all season, and we get to go to state. Yes, they do. State bound. The Lawrenceburg Tigers are getting ready for the state championship game for the first time in decades, folks. The team left by bus from the high school just a short time ago for the state capitol and a chance to practice inside Lucas Oil Field. How exciting. It's great. This is great. And they're going to be playing in front of thousands of people, of course, a lot more than the friendly confines of Tiger Field back home. Nine on your side is Tom McKee. Spent the day in Lawrenceburg and found the community has the team's back for sure. Well, Lawrenceburg's football team won state titles in 1975, 1978, and they were runners-up in 1985. Well, this time, 31 years later, this group of seniors wants to add to that trophy case by beating the cadets of Fort Wayne Concordia. And let me tell you, right now, this town has tiger fever, and it has it real bad. You can't go anywhere in Lawrenceburg right now without seeing some sort of reminder that the Tigers are playing for the state football championship on Saturday in Indianapolis. Just look at the artwork in the window of Whitey's Wine and Liquor Company. There's no doubt who this business is backing. It was painted by the family of manager Gert Kaffenberger. All of our sports this fall have done awesome, and Tigers have done an awesome job. And I'm just excited for the boys on the football team. Great. They're just great. Attorney Andrew Bowdendistel admired the windows at the Vota and Schwartz law firm, firmly supporting the Tiger train. My whole family is going to be going up. I get to share it with my son now, so it's uh, everybody takes great pride in it. Ticket sales for the game were brisk at the high school all morning. Jeremy Hopper is a Lawrenceburg graduate and played for the Tigers when he was in school. There's no way he was going to miss this game. This is a football town, always has been, and it's nice to see it get back to where it belongs. The Tiger Touchdown Club was swamped with hundreds of orders for a t-shirt fans can wear to the game. People were buying two, three, four, and more of them, including Heather Karekas. They have played their heart out all season, and they've shown it on the field and off the field, and we get to go to state. They've done very well. Angie Ruberg organized the effort to honor her son, a senior football player, and all of his teammates. We have alumni coming back from years ago, so proud of the town, just the boys. I mean, everyone's just pumped. Everyone wants a t-shirt. Everyone wants to represent Lawrenceburg. Well, the Tigers are going to be coming home tonight back to Lawrenceburg after they finish their practice at Lucas Oil Stadium. Tomorrow, they practice here at the pit. Friday, they practice at the pit. Saturday morning, 10 o'clock, police escort, big send-off at 10 o'clock in the morning for that championship game. Tom McKean out on your side, live in Lawrenceburg.